Welcome back to another video everybody. So today we have a couple of third party packs that we picked up at Target. So the way I thought about going about this was I saw um, TCG Funhouse. I'll go ahead and put the picture on the top right. Check them out. They have some really good content. They uh, recently did a video of this where they opened up uh, these third party packs at Target and um, they usually had one of them had a vintage pack in it so I'm all about vintage packs so I really wanted to try this out myself um, so we're gonna go ahead and see what we can get in here and if if in the event we don't get any vintage we'll go ahead and open up the vintage pack that we got in our last video where we opened up the mystery power boxes so we'll go ahead and see what we got there Alright, so in these packs, because I am unfamiliar with this, Mario, what are we trying to aim for? Just these vintage packs, or...? Um, I know, I know they have a chance to get at least one vintage pack, but, um, we'll see. We never know with these third-party packs. There's always some random stuff we can get from here, so we'll see. If anything, we all, we do have a vintage pack to open up here. So let's go ahead and break into them. All right, so now we are back. We just finished opening them. And again, uh, I apologize for the lighting because, you know, at this moment, we currently have no electricity, so. Yeah, we literally just came out of, I don't know, came out of the Hurricane Hannah. And I mean, in my area, for some reason, in like the neighborhood I live in, my house decides to have the area where it doesn't have electricity and we drove around and there was electricity in other houses. But long story short, we're still gonna upload some videos. And so this is what we have. We got the right and left side of, you know, Mario's pools and then my pools. So, how do you want to do this? So, let's go ahead and reveal at least the mystery foil cards that we're getting. So, the first one here is a Reverse Hollow Magneton and a Lightning Rock. Okay, next one is a Bronzor and a Mudsdale. Okay, nothing special there. These are... <gasps> oh, you, got, you actually got a Dragonite. Dragonite foil and a, a re reverse Rattata. Nothing special. <clears throat> I feel like I'm already up. <laughs> okay, so let's look at the packs. We're looking for vintage here. So let's go ahead and stack them. Okay. And go ahead and see if we got it. So we have an Evolutions, a Celestial Storm. Pretty nice. I've never opened those. A Burning Shadows, that's pretty cool. Another Breakthrough, and another Evolution. So no Vintage Packs on mine. Let's see what you got. Okay, so I got a... Steam Siege, pretty garbage. Burning and Shadows. Shadows. Oh, we got a Team, team up. up. Okay, that's nice. Okay. Um, Cosmic, Cosmic Eclipse, and... and Unified Mind. Yeah. Okay. Oh, keep in mind, if you hear cars traveling, it's because we do have the windows open, so... Yeah, we... It's gonna be a pretty, um, pretty basic video today, but at least we get, we get to open some packs. So let's see what we get. So what do you want to open first? I got um, two evolutions I can crack in. Two evolutions? Yeah. Well, I don't have evolutions. Why don't you open up that garbage Steam Siege pack? Steam Siege. Yeah, right there on the bottom. Okay. So. So, Steam Siege is probably, probably one of the worst. I can already tell yeah, with this card. Yeah, probably one of the worst sets they've ever done. Four? I, it should be four. No. Is that the rare? I guess so. Who cares? It's Steam Siege. No one really, no one really wants to see Steam Siege. You should do that. Comment down below which set was by far the worst set yeah. ever made by Pokemon. I'm pretty sure everyone can agree it's Steam Siege. Alright. Okay. What are 
you opening up? I'm gonna open up both the evolutions. That one opened up pretty easy. This one is three to the front. Okay, Switch, Magmar, Devolution Spray, Electabuzz, Magikarp, Ghastly, Poliwag, Pikachu, Reverse Rare Gyarados, and a Starmie. Okay, you can pick whatever pack you want, guys. Um, so Team Up, you said it was pretty okay, right? Team Up was actually a really good set, if you want to go ahead and open that one. I'll, I'll save the best for last, so okay. Unified Mind will be up. Be up next. So what do you what have you heard from the I guess Pokemon world about um, the new hidden fates like reprint? Re yeah, reprint. So apparently it's gonna be hitting stores in September. Mainly it's gonna be Target and Walmart that are gonna be getting a restock on I think just their tins. I'm not too sure if Walmart Walmart's already done with their um, their Hidden Fates collection boxes, the ones that we have in front for our background here. But if they do do a reprint, I said do do. If they do do a reprint, that's gonna be really great for casual and casual people who just wanna open up cards for fun. It, it may take, collectors may take a hit because what they do is, um, you know, buy up a lot of inventory and then resell it. I wouldn't say, I wouldn't call them collectors. I would say the the ones that buy them for profit, mm -hmm. like they they buy a lot and they resell. It, it may decrease the value, but who knows? It's just more chances for, uh, for a shiny Zard, you know, shiny Charizard. That's always a, that's always a good thing. So, which one is this one? Breakthrough? This one is oh, Cosmic. Cosmic I have not opened up Breakthrough in forever. I remember I tried going back at one point to get to get back into Pokemon, so I opened up with Breakthrough and Breakpoint, and even Fates Collide. And then those, they had some pretty good, pretty okay cards. People don't, I don't think they really like the Fates Collide much either. But I, I got some nice pulls out of them. I think I got like a, oh, a Black Hiram. Hollow. I think I had gotten like a Mega Scissor 4. Okay, I'm gonna go with Break Three. Okay. Here's the code card. Okay, Chatop, Ramble, Haunter, Frogadoo, Zora, Vanillite, Flababy, Zora, Fennekin, Reverse Paris. Oh, did I do it wrong? Breakthrough, is that is Breakthrough the same as Evolution? No way, the Chatot was over there? Guess that's why not many people like me. Okay, I'm gonna do the burning shadows. Mm -hmm. Water energy, Whirlipede, Wobbuffet, Electric, Sneasel, Alolan Vulpix, Horsey, Noibat, Alolan Grimer, Gyarados Reverse, and a Slow King. Wow, so really nothing out of this third party pack. I'm not really surprised, but can you imagine the hyper rare Charizard out of the Burning Shadows pack from a third party Walmart? I mean, well, we got third party target. target pack. Guard. So this one is four to the front. Lightning energy. 
Perlia, Olivia, Lunatone, Caterpie, Meryl, Rhyhorn, Sandy Gas, Hoot Hoot, Porygon 2, and a Turtle. Okay. The team. Let's see. Let's see if we can get something. I'm just take a deep breath. Water energy. Spirit Tuner. Viridian Forest. Rapidat. Dutini. Tentacruel. Ponyta. Hello and Grimer, Cosmo, Weedle Reverse, and a Ferrothorn. Wow, so not one. Oh well, you got a hollow, but I wouldn't count a hollow. Last one is a Celestial Storm. Okay. Watch this be the one pack we actually get something out. Not too sure on Celestial Storm. I'll say three to the front. Teleper, Soul Rock, Lifebird, Slack Off, Love Disc, Electrite, C Dot, Wingle, Dunsparce, and a Waylord. Wow, so nothing. Nothing out of these packs. So, what are you saying, Mario? I don't know. It, the third party target products, I'm pretty sure they just like stuff, they may have stuffed weight packs in there just to get them out of whatever inventory, but if they throw in vintage, I mean, if you're hunting for vintage, try to look through the sides of them and maybe you might see a vintage pack. Vintage. So, as promised, we'll go ahead and open up this vintage storm front that we pulled in the mystery power boxes. Wow. How many packs were those five packs? I, I don't know about the card tricks, so we'll just go. There were five five cards, five boosters in, in each uh, box, so Skorupi, Tangela, Finneon, Mistrevis, Magikarp, a Bibro. Oh, we actually got a hollow. A hollow Miss Magius. Okay, a hollow vintage. And then the last three Miltank, Electrode, and Pokedraw. Okay, so we actually got a, a vintage hollow Miss Magius. Not bad. Okay. Well, our review on those target third party packs, pretty garbage. Unless you happen to pull a vintage pack, then pretty okay. But the chances of that are all on you. If you can spot the vintage pack on the sides, then go for it. If not. But how many packs were there at Target Team? Of those, yeah. the third parties, there was a bunch. We probably went through a bunch, and I don't really, I didn't really see any. But like about like what seven, maybe eight. Like ten. Ten. Yeah, we went through a bunch of them. So out of ten, there's probably no vintage packs. Yeah, I mean, you're probably gonna have to get pretty lucky to spot one. But I mean, if you do, go for it. If not, if you want to take the risk, it's like a twenty dollar risk. So. Yikes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So that's it for today. Bye. Bye.